to students welcome in the third part of the chapter number 1 observe this equation they will ask you the question solve these equations by cramer's rule for the cramer's rule you have to remember two things that the equation should be in one form x then y then equals to the number so observe this equation is that this equation is in that form no so you have to write it like this 3x minus 4y minus goes on that side so you get it 10 observe this equation yes this equation is in correct form so you have to write it below to this one 4x plus 3y equals to 5 and then you have to find out the value of d how can i find out the value of d so it is very simple write down the coefficient of x and y as it is x 3 then here 4 here you have to write the coefficient of y minus 4 and plus 3 now what you have to do you have to cross multiply to this part so here 3 into 3 then minus this to this 4 into minus 4 so here you get it 3 3 is a 9 minus 4 into 4 16 minus plus minus so 9 minus minus plus so your answer is here 25 the value of d is 25 Now you have to find out the value of dx. So how can I find out the value of dx? How to remember this? Let me tell you the fantastic idea. dx means what? Here you have to remember my idea. Delete x. Delete x means what? Don't write the coefficient of x. So I'm not going to write the, these values. So which are the remaining value? Minus four and three. If I deleted the value of x, then how can I write the values of this one? It's very simple. Which are the remaining value? Ten and five. So you have to write the value of ten and five here. So now again the cross multiply. Ten into three, then minus five into minus four. So equals to ten three is a thirty. Then minus minus will be plus five four the twenty. Your answer for the dx is fifty. Now we can find out the value of dy. So I told you to remember dy delete y. So here now I am not going to write the value coordinates of y. So x I am going to write it here three and four. Then, which value you have to write it here? If I deleted the values of y, so which values are remaining? Ten and five. So here I am going to write it ten and five. So again, cross multiplication to this one: three into five minus four into ten. So three five is a fifteen minus four ten is a forty. So it will remain minus twenty five. So this is the value of dy. Now we have to find out the solution of x and y. So the x value equals to dx upon d. So dx here I got it fifty, and the d value is twenty five. So twenty five to the fifty. The value of x is two. Now y equal to dy upon d dy value is minus 25 and d value is 25 25 ones are 25 and therefore the solution of this equation is equals to 2 minus 1 so here you have to remember the one thing i am going to tell you for the cramer's rule you have to find out the three values d dx and dy d Means the coefficient of x and y. These are the coefficient of x. D 
these are the coefficient of y for the dx i told you the idea delete x delete x means what don't write the values of x you have to write the values of y and the remaining value 10 and 5 then dy delete y delete y means i am going to delete this value so it means you have to write the value of x 3 and 4 then which value you have to write it instead of y 5 and 10 then find the values of dx dy you will get it the values of x and y x equal to dx upon d and then y equal to dy upon d thank you